the Heritage Park and Terrace has found a creative way to keep their doors open this season. The museum plans to operate with self-guided tours of no more than 10 people per group. Starting tomorrow, guests will be able to book a 45-minute time slot between 11 a.m. and 5 p.m. on Tuesdays to Saturdays. Museum curator Anna Glass says there's a list of rules guests must abide by when touring the grounds. We just ask that they don't touch anything, which really should be a policy in all museums, but especially now we can't afford to sanitize artifacts because it does damage the artifact itself. So we do have our summer student who is our programmer and she will be monitoring all the tours. We have security cameras, so we are able to view them while keeping the six meter distance. And then we also have staff going around and uh, disinfecting after each tour. We will not have any public washrooms open. She explains what visitors can expect when they arrive and the resources available to them. We have created booklets to kind of guide them throughout the property. And we also are providing mini exhibits in our Dix's Dance Hall. So the exhibit we will have for the first few weeks is on medical and hospital history in Terrace. Our pamphlet, it not only serves as a good self-guided tour, but it actually has some interactive things on it for children so they can try to find certain artifacts within the building. Glass says the season and its hours have been cut short due to receiving less funding than previous years, which has reduced the number of hours of the summer students. For CFTK-TV News, I'm Hillary Johnson.